Now that the valiant protesters have won, as might have been expected in the Battle of Portland, it seems someone got the hint and read the damn book. The state police of Oregon have taken over for the federal troops, the thugs from ICE and Federal Protection Services, Blackwater, and uh, Border Patrol. The building remains standing. The building remains unmolested. The protests continue until, of course, the underlying issues have been addressed, as told in FM 3-24. You may remember we were doing a series, chapter by chapter, and number three was talking about culture. <clears throat> Once again, the uh, underlying message that rebellions only happen when the government is unable or unwilling to address the group's concerns. And their concerns were police brutality against our black brothers and sisters, which as you know, is just simply plain stupid and wrong. We're all human beings, and that is what matters. Plus, you cannot say, well, they're criminals. No. Where's the judge? Where's the trial? Where's the defense attorney? Where's all that data and information? You're not a criminal until you are convicted of a criminal offense. Until then, you are merely a suspect. Get your terms right to straighten out to clean your mind. These people are not insurgents. They're not agitators. They're protesters. You're your neighbor. They're your mom. They're somebody's dad, you know? Leaf blowers. Goodness gracious. Stop being ridiculous. This is your fellow Americans saying, stop it. We want the principles of policing as written by Sir John Peel, who started the police force in the first place, as a proper police force, civilian type. Good God, man, get it sensible. You wouldn't like to be hauled off, thrown into the back of a minivan, trundled somewhere, and asked to waive your rights. I don't think so, Charlie. Right? When your wife's purse grabbed and gone through, and along with her, take her cell phone, find out who she has her hair done by. Yeah, the plane was actually surveilling, and we see today the DHS was monitoring the communications of the protesters without their express written permission. Yeah. Spy, spy, spy. So that is done. What's the next thing he's going to get up to? In any case, thank you for watching. And please do come again. Well, I'll undoubtedly talk about something else. Probably, uh... Oh, I don't know. How about some physics? Thank you for watching, and please do come again.